Wildfire near San Francisco burns 12,000 acres, forces evacuations, and road closures. The Corral fire blaze in San Joaquin County has only been 15 percent, contained officials said. A Northern California wildfire has burned thousands of acres, forced evacuations, and left two firefighters injured this weekend. Flames spread through San Joaquin County on Saturday, prompting authorities to evacuate neighborhoods southwest of Tracy after the blaze, dubbed the Corral Fire, closed part of Interstate Highway 580 and continued to threaten communities. On Sunday morning, officials said the fire grew to 12,500 acres and was 15 percent contained. Strong winds and grass were still an issue as the weekend stretched on, making the flames difficult to contain, officials said. More than 400 personnel have been assigned to the blaze and are said to be making progress. Weather conditions became more favorable for firefighters, allowing crews to make progress constructing and improving control lines, Cal Fire said in a statement. The San Joaquin County Office of Emergency Services asked residents east of Highway 580, between Corral Hollow Road and South Tracy Boulevard to leave first. A temporary evacuation point was established at Larch Clover Community Center, CBS News reported. It's not clear what caused the fire. Two Alameda County firefighters were taken to hospitals for treatment of minor to moderate burns, according to the outlet. The National Weather Service reported that winds in the hills west of Tracy were 20 to 25 miles per hour, gusting to 43 miles per hour. Winds were expected to be elevated until midnight on Sunday. Cal Fire said that the fire was reported at 2.39 p.m. on Saturday near Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory Site 300 and had reached 30 acres by 4.45 p.m. before jumping to 4,920 acres. The fire was 10 percent contained by 7.35 p.m., Cal Fire said. The blaze is the first major wildfire this year in California marking the beginning of the state's wildfire season.